Dave and I are at Lake Cavanaugh today. We're going to bicycle around the lake. It should be a nice loop. Um, beautiful day. Very cold. Um, we're parked here at the public boat launch. I don't think there's a lot of public parking around Lake Cavanaugh. So if you have a Discover Pass, this is, I think, the best place. So coming in off of 530, going up a very windy road, which is uh, dirt at Pothold. This is the sign you see when you get there. So it actually says Magnolia Bike Route. The sign says it's closed about a mile ahead. I think it's just for cars. I know when we were up here last time, there was a washout, so I'm hoping it might be narrower, but not so narrow that a bike can't easily get through. So this is why the road is closed to traffic. Washed out. But bicycles definitely can get through this part right now. There's like a few more washouts ahead. Probably a dangerous landslide too. I think we're okay right now. Yeah, there's definitely a kind of ridge in the road where you can tell it's gonna go eventually here. There's another spot where it's eroded pretty bad. here. So the loop around Lake Cavanaugh is about eight miles. Um, there was no place that a bike couldn't easily make it through. Uh, it's pretty much all paved. I don't think we hit any dirt. There's a few little tiny potholes, but really easy going. There are some hills, a um, little under 300 miles of cumulative elevation gain, and um, you got a good mix of forest, um, a lot of streams flowing through, beautiful lake views, and passing a lot of private property, so, you know, be respectful 
Um, the community seems really nice and welcoming to um, people saying good morning. A lot of people out walking, very, very low amount of traffic on these roads. It's pretty cool.